Hey there, my gaming family. Me again, bringing you guys the news from the week that's just passed. Let's see what has been happening. Right, anti-heroes and their family values in video games and the upcoming movie Run All Night, which is releasing tonight, funny enough, Friday the 13th. So, basically, Tom has been going in depth trying to figure out what really motivates these anti-heroes to do what they do in either their games or their films, whatever it is at the time. This is sort of like a build-up to the movie that's, that's just been released. So guys, seriously, have a look at this one. This is going to be one of the more interesting ones, the, one of the more interesting reviews that have come out in the past few weeks. So, get into the site and check this one out. So, Uncharted 4, sadly, is being delayed until Spring 2016. This means for you guys who are on the PS4 at the moment, the delay is going to be even longer. The wait is going to take even longer. But is it necessarily a bad thing? After looking at this trailer from E3 recently, or the E3 in 2014, and seeing how good the, the expectations from this game is, the guys from Naughty, Naughty Dog have said that they need more time just to get the game up to what standards you know most of us gamers would actually prefer because if you look at what's been happening recently games that have been coming out triple a titles that have been coming out that have been broken that have to have same day fixes that have to have patch after patch after patch just to have the game running and working correctly is becoming a bit tedious to most of the gamers and they've just become more and more cynical of these titles so, to be honest, let's look at it from a different perspective, saying, yes, guys, take longer if you need to. Bring out a game that is actually a masterpiece rather than a broken game. Also in the news this week, the British Academy Games Awards have finally released the, or announced their winners. Now, among these top names, you're going to find games like Left Behind from The Last of Us, you're going to find Destiny, you're going to find Far Cry 4, Alien Isolation, and League of Legends, among but a few of the AAA titles that you can see or that you've been playing recently. So, guys, do yourselves a favor and go and check it out. See what's been happening and see who the game winners or the award winners are. And... See for yourself whether they deserve to win or not. I mean, after all, you are the gamers. It's up to you whether you're going to play these games or not. Last in the news this week, Bandai Namco and Slightly Mad Studios have decided to move the date for their new game, Project Cars, to mid-May 2015. The developers have said that the reason why is because they want to make sure that the game is perfectly, perfectly polished to give the gamers a better experience. So. Do you think the production companies and the game developers are starting to learn their lessons from all of the mistakes that they've made recently of giving us broken games and noticing that the gamers are actually starting to get highly, highly annoyed? I think they probably are. So anyway, that's it for the news. So guys, that's it from me, The Ross, from Gamers for the Win. Remember, if you liked us enough, you can subscribe down at the bottom. Or you can visit us at www.gamersftw.co.uk And remember guys, keep on gaming!